What is up my awesome gemstones? It's Mary Gem and I'm back with another video and today's video is going to be on what turns them on. So it's definitely 18 plus. It's super juicy, super in detail. I'm super excited. Um, we have three pals here today. Um, pal number one says love yourself first. Pal two says handkerchief. And pile number three says Ferrari. And there's like a little car with a stop sign. So yeah, these are the three pals. Watch the entire video if you can. Think about the message you'd like to hear. Think about your person. And let's have some fun. Okay, what is up my awesome gemstones? So I'm sitting like this just because... I felt like it. I feel like we need to do something, you know, a little bit spicier because today's video is going to be on um, what turns them on, what are they turn ons. So, um, yes, okay, I'm a very awkward person, so please bear with me. Um, but yeah, I feel like I haven't done an 18 plus, like, spicy reading, like a sex reading in a while, so. If my family is busy watching, please exit. Anyone that I know is busy watching, please exit. I'm talking about you, person. If you're from my school, please leave. If you just know me personally, please leave, okay? Thank you very much. We're all adults here. We're all adults. We're all above 18, okay? Okay, um... So, Sydney Love and Light, hope you're having an amazing day as well. I don't know how to sit. <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna sit like this. Hopefully my arm doesn't get tired. Oh wait. Oh, that's way better. Okay, let me just... Are you guys comfortable? Are you guys comfortable? And sorry my head's a bit cut off, but anyways, so... Yeah, anyways. Part number one, you guys chose love yourself first, okay? So, what are the turn-ons? Okay, so I'm busy hearing that they like someone that is really confident. I feel like when... You're, you could definitely be someone that's very dominant, but yeah, I'm hearing that they're really into soft doms. They like someone that's persistent and dominant, but like not too dominant. Like yeah, I'm hearing soft dom is something that they like a lot. You know, someone that is very nurturing, very caring, really like just has soft dom energy. I don't know that much about soft doms, but yeah, like they like someone that's very confident, someone that just, even if they don't know what they're doing they fake it till they make it like there's this leo energy about them if you get on top you know they like the performances i'm hearing that they yeah they love performances okay wait i can't sit like this <laughs> okay this is a bit better but anyways i feel like i'm just so close to the camera i don't want to be close to the camera but yeah let me know if this is really bad like if i'm too close to the camera just let, let me know anyways so yeah they like it when someone is just like nah bro i'm way too close to the camera <laughs> i don't like it <laughs> anyways i feel like i'm gonna just post this on my second channel because yeah i'm gonna post this on my second channel anyways so yeah that really turns them on like if you get on top like they like performances they like it when someone screams loud in their ear they love the vocal shit you know i'm hearing they even like like pulling on the ears or like they have very sensitive ears so they like it if someone caresses their ears licks in their ears they like bringing things in the bedroom i'm just hearing the more traumatic the better fam this person could definitely have a venus in aries venus in gemini Venus and Gemini are freaks, bro. They are such freaks. Like they will, they know how to please you. If you have a Venus Gemini, bro, mm, like let me know. Then you guys are winners. Like, oof. Okay. Anyways, um, it also could be demisexual as well. I don't know why I'm hearing that, but yeah, like they just like it when someone's very confident and they just own everything that they have. So if you have like little itty bitty titties, you know, just own it. I feel like be confident with it. Be creative with it as well. They like it when someone tries new things in the bedroom um like don't be afraid to yeah try different things and like get on top as well don't be afraid to um you know be a little bit dominant but like yeah soft dom vibes don't be too like aggressive because i'm hearing like they don't like aggressive shit. like they don't want you to like pull on their ears and like yank on them and like shout and stuff but like they like screaming you know i feel like screaming and shouting is different you know like they like the sh screaming um they like the like pulling of the lobes and like that type of vibe and like licking the ears like very they love that whole thing 
like they I'm hearing that they have a very sensitive tip so I feel like if you go really slow with the tip like they're gonna be really into that as well and um yeah just like they have a very, they're very sensitive i feel like their body's very sensitive so like the the lighter you go the more they're going to be turned on so like you know when it comes to down there let's say the tennis balls like just slowly caressing it like that type of vibe and like the tip you know slowly caressing oh my god i'm gonna get demonetized it's fine just like be super sensitive with it when it comes to like going down here like you know licking them all the way down there like just super light you know like i'm hearing like keep putting your tongue everywhere just be super light like they could definitely be into edging bro like 100% they could be into edging because i'm just hearing like them say like almost almost not there not yet <laughs> oh my gosh guys i'm serious you guys better watch this video and like and comment because i'm i'm not gonna monetize this video i'll make sure that i don't monetize it okay so we have the ace of swords that came up right if you can see this card over here like look at this bondage bitch i was literally just telling you like they're saying like dominate me like it's fine like it's okay if you dominate me like they're into handcuffs but yeah the softer the better like don't be like pounding them and stuff like that so like if you are the um the the masculine person like don't be dominant like i'm hearing like it's about rhythm it's not about going hard and stuff like that like they do not like that hard shit they're saying no soft and gentle and caressing and like um passionate very like minimal like it's it's not even minimal though because i'm hearing like they want the the thea theatrics but like at the same time they're saying like just don't don't go hard go soft it's soft dom soft dom bro okay so if you don't know what soft dom is please google it just check what that means because yeah they're really into the soft dom vibes okay I'm, they are into pet names as well i'm hearing that they could really be into that like they could have a praise kink as well <laughs> oh my gosh but yeah a praise kink so just basically reassuring them the whole time saying oh yeah like that's a good little that's a good pet you know that type of vibe mm -hmm. but yeah they're into that like just telling them that they're doing a good job and saying yes yeah you like like encouraging them so they could be someone that enjoys watching and like just you know flipping the pedal while like you watch and encourage them like they like that as well they're really into that like just like telling them that they're doing a good job and like encouraging them keeping good eye contact and just like like i said just like holding it and stroking and like being really soft like they could definitely be like a touch me not and that's why it's so sensitive and so sensual with them okay um but yeah i'm also hearing that they want you to like they want to pull your hair they want to touch your hair and like they want to know if that's okay with you like even if you have like short hair because this person does have short hair if you can see so like i'm hearing like they want to like put their hands in your hair and like that's what they want to do like they're really into that so um they also can sometimes be someone that's very aggressive and i feel like that's why they don't like it when someone's aggressive with them back you know they don't want you exactly to match their energy they want you to just be yourself and be like yeah soft on Okay, that's the last time I'm going to say soft on, but... Spirit, what turns power one on? Mm, I'm actually liking this reading, okay? Then we have the King of Pentacles. <gasps> yes, bro. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This person is literally saying, like, they want you to encourage them. So they're really into that vibe where it's, like, them just, like, you know... Like I said, flipping the pedal. And then, like, you just, like, standing there in the corner and, like, taking your clothes off and, like, touching yourself and enjoying yourself. Because I feel like if you enjoy yourself, you're, they're going to enjoy themselves, okay? If you're having a good time, if you're making yourself feel good, if you're making yourself, you know, ocean vibes, ocean ocean five, maroon five down there, um, then they're also going to do the same thing back, okay? Like, they're really into that. Um, but, yeah, they really want to make you feel good. They're really into hand things so um yeah make sure your hands are super clean be hygienic you know like i'm hearing like they love being touched like like below the waist maybe they they yeah like they don't like being touched with their hands you maybe it's like like your lips and your tongue can go here but like not your hands but your hands inside there at the bottom they love that okay 
and um, they want you to encourage them like they're really into praising okay so just constant reassurance and constantly saying yes you're doing great da -da 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 -da, that type of thing and like pet names calling them king emperor um, empress whichever gender whoever you're with however many people you're with okay so um yeah they love sheer things okay i'm hearing that like they're really into um even chasing and like running away like they could be into that vibe where it's like they want to chase you <gasps> like running around the bedroom like they're really into that like you could be like try and catch me if you can you know like running around like you could be like um going and maybe like if you're wearing your like let's say a bra and panty or like whatever you're wearing you could be like you can take one article of clothing off and like run away or like leading them you know like leaving your clothes like from maybe the bathroom to the bedroom and like just like leaving them a trail like they like that whole teasing vibe you know they like the whole suspense until you guys get to the actual business so yeah spirit um what turns power one on whoa so many cards just came out okay we have the nine of pentacles that came upright so they know what they're doing they're very experienced okay don't be alarmed by them telling you what they like and what they don't like because i'm hearing that they can be very vocal and maybe sometimes i might say no don't do that i'm not into that so i'm just hearing like um not don't get sensitive about it don't get sensitive about it but like i feel like it's not a bad thing if someone tells you what they like doing it's a good thing you know so don't don't get too much in your head about that like if they say no i don't like that don't do that or like no don't do that um yeah don't get too sensitive about it because it's a good thing they want you to like they're telling you what they want and what they like you know and um yeah but the nine of pentacles you can see this person's busy cutting off this person's hair okay so i'm just hearing like they want the hair out of your face they don't want you to like get the hair in your face so you know put your hair up in a bun i don't know shave it off the day before <laughs> but um yeah maybe they like it clean shaved i think they could have a preference for that but you know obviously you don't gotta shave if you don't want to shave okay period it's your own hair if you don't want to shave don't shave period okay i'm with you okay you don't gotta shave if you don't want to but yeah, I feel like they could have a preference for that. And, um, yeah, like I said, teasing the articles of clothing. So, I'll do one more card and then I'm going to go to the next pile, okay? If I can find, oh, there it is. So, let's wear it, what turns pile one on? We have the chariot that came up, right? They could definitely be a cancer, okay? So I'm just hearing like if you're having a good time, they're gonna have a good time. So like bro, literally before you guys even start, like you need to be on the bed already flipping your own pan. And flipping your own pan is code for if you couldn't already tell so like i'm hearing like they're into that way it's like they want you to be already flipping the pan like you need to be doing the thing already like going down in there like doing that yourself you know like do it you know and like they want to be walking in on you and like that type of thing like they're really into that you know like they like going deep 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 so yeah prepare for that okay and that is what i've got for part number one i hope it resonated and i hope my family wasn't watching because r.i.p i'm gonna get grounded <laughs> but okay part number two you guys chose the handkerchief card okay so i'm hearing that this person is really into cleanliness okay they're really into the aftermath of what's happening so i feel like there's someone that isn't really obsessed with the whole act of actually you know Mm -mm -mm, whatever happens whatever you guys do whatever it is okay i feel like they're more into like what happens around it so they're really into foreplay like foreplay is a huge thing for them i'm hearing that like they like oh my god i wasn't even gonna do this and then i realized so there could be someone that like they like it like if someone shoves their fingers down their throat or like they like like choking they're into choking oh my god they're into choking they're into bondage oh my gosh i feel like some yeah yeah this person is into choking fam they're in they have a choking thing like yes like just like slightly be safe obviously bro be safe be safe be safe okay don't say mary jim told you to do that stuff no 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 be safe okay be safe this video is for entertainment purposes only okay okay and it's all consensual okay so yeah they are into um they're into choking definitely and i feel like they're into bondage and um going down like they love foreplay like they want you to be able to like really 
like I'm hearing like you need like your throat bro mm -hmm. going down like they're gonna be like putting their hands around your neck and like things are gonna be going in your mouth bro so I'm hearing like um you know like they like it slobbery they like wet slobbery so you guys might be ending up using lube so yeah don't be afraid to buy lube and like that type of thing like it's fine it's normal go get it like not everyone can you know that so yeah and it's gonna be more comfortable if you have lube so yeah i'm hearing like the slobbier it is the better like they like sloppy toffee like they like that sloppy stuff so they like it when it's like just like super easy to do it so <gasps> not me busy <laughs> but yeah so it's like they okay take what resonates but like i'm hearing that they might even be into it like even if you're on your period like they even could be into that farm. I don't know, like I'm hearing them say like it's easier to like put in. Like they actually like that, you know. So yeah, and I'm hearing like they don't even mind if you like don't shave or whatever. Like I'm just hearing them say like they like it sloppy. Like they love sloppies. Like they like standing up. They like that whole um, like kitchen counter. Like they like it being like just like super rough and ratchet. Like ratchet in like a good way where it's like, it's like a ratchet type like ah take it from the back like that type of vibe like they're into that type of stuff you know like they're into that and um like you know like throwing around and like um this like you know like breakup sex where it's like there's like all this tension like I'm really like they're into that where it's kind of like <laughs> I can't take myself seriously but um yeah so sorry Okay, let's so What is what turns pile number two on? Mm. So two cards came out. We have the King of Wands that came upright. Okay, they like standing. They like standing. Like literally, this is confirmation that they like standing. Um, so they could definitely be into that and like taking it from the back and taking it from the front as well. And also, I'm hearing that maybe there's someone that doesn't like eye contact. They could like it, like if it's like completely pitch dark and like you can't see them. Because I'm hearing like them saying like get it from the back or like 69 or something like they don't want to be looking at your face. Or well, they don't want you to look at their face. I don't know, maybe like they have a weird face when they come. Yeah, I feel like they probably have a weird face when they're like, when they climax. So they could just be like saying, um, I'm self-conscious about that. So yeah, they definitely could have some body issues. So it's like, they like doing any position where it's like, you can't see their stomach that much. Or you can't see, yeah, you can't see their stomach maybe. Or where like, you can't, you aren't that close to their face. Like they don't like the way it's kind of like that missionary type of vibe. They're like, nah. Um, it's more like standing or like they like putting their head on your shoulder and that type of thing um, They like scratching on the back like I'm just hearing like they want their face covered They want it like pitch black or whatever, you know So yeah standing, you know one leg up one leg down all that vibes um, But yeah, they even like this like hugging embrace bro like even like just like holding each other and then like y'all just doing it like standing Okay, and then we have the Nine of Chalices, the Nine of Cups that came upright. So, like I said, they're really into talking. I feel like they're really into dirty talk as well. Um, like, I'm definitely hearing the song Pillow Talk by Zayn Malik. Um, and just, like, saying, like, a lot of dirty things. Like, they're really into that as well. And, like, even just talking afterwards, like, they like the whole aftercare. I feel like that's really important to them. So, like, what turns them on is aftercare, you know? Because that's very important, you know? Like, the act of, you know, doing it is, like, great and everything. But afterwards, it's important that you hold your partner or partners. It's important that you, um, ask if they're okay, get them water, you cuddle with them, whatever it is. But you can't just, like... I mean, but I feel like they're into the whole sloppy though. Like, I feel like, yeah, they're into that though. But, um, aftercare is important too. So, um, I feel like afterwards you can maybe just like offer them water or something. Or you could, I don't know, get some snacks, get some food. Um, like they like going for different rounds. Like I'm hearing like they want to go for like 30 minutes and stop, 30 minutes and stop. Like they like taking breaks in between or like every 10 minutes, every 20 minutes. Um, hopefully it's every 30 minutes. <laughs> I'm joking. It depends, man. It depends. So, yeah, I'm just hearing, like, they like taking breaks, okay? Um, yeah, but, like, they're super self-conscious. This person is really self-conscious. So I just feel like it's important that whatever positions you guys do do, um, just make sure that it's comfortable for everyone. So if you don't feel comfortable doing something, let them know. And if 
yeah, they don't feel comfortable doing something vice versa. Communication is very important and I feel like it turns them on when someone's like constantly telling them. So like you could tell them what makes you insecure. Like I see them even wanting to kiss like the areas that you are like feel insecure about, you know? Like maybe they have like acne or like scarring and it's like they just don't want people to see that or something. So yeah, they like holding hands as well during um they're into that definitely. But yeah, scratching and like a lot of hickeys and love bites. Like I'm really like they want to have marks afterwards okay even though i'm busy hearing like there could be some tears in this bro there could be a cryo you could be a cryo or well, they don't mind like if you start crying because it's that good <laughs> they like that thing where it's like saying you know in call me by your name i know problematic but like call me by your name with like he's like um call me by your name and i'll call you by mine and then he's like elio 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 like that type of vibe like they want you to say their name or like say my name say my name say my name like that vibe i feel like they're into it so like constantly say their name while they're busy doing it with you be like say their name be like mary jam mary jam like that type of vibe you know i'm ashamed of myself right now i can't believe i'm saying all this on the internet right now anyways um, what don't spell to on spirit? It is what it is. Um, we have the magician card, okay? This is someone that is in control, someone that's really smart, and they know how to make you bust a nut. They know how to make you bust in. It's a bust in, okay? I'm hearing that, like, them saying, like, I'm seeing them getting, like, a freaking uh, handkerchief, a scarf, whatever, putting it in there, and, like, just wanting to munch down, fam. Like, they're saying munch it down don't be afraid to munch it down you know like they might even be into booty they want to eat your booty from the, they want to eat your booty but like they're like from the back they want to eat your booty they could be into that okay um yeah they're into like sucking a lot a lot of sucking i'm hearing like i'm seeing them sucking 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 so you're gonna get a lot of life love bites all over you okay they're into that um and they're into like if you have your hands behind your back and like you're just like standing they like kind of like you know like let them do whatever you know like i'm your obviously consensual but like i feel like they're into that like if you have your hands above your head i would put my hands above my head but i didn't shave okay i don't really care but um yeah so like you know putting your hands behind your 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 back and everything like that type of vibe or um like standing on your knees like they're into that like okay i'm like not me busy showing you but like that type of thing like just like being on your knees they're like the whole squatting position you know the <laughs> whole I feel like they're into that okay so like when you're in the bedroom you know get on all fours arch that back bitch arch that back arch it okay arch it and then um yeah keep that like keep the slender like they like the maybe even like dancing while you guys are busy doing it they like the whole like just like keeping it flowy keeping it airy and like moving your neck around and like you know doing the whole thing if you have like hair like you know playing with your hair when you're busy doing it and just like being all like like you know playing music keeping it light keeping it fun and airy okay Whew, cha. okay spirit what turns part number two on what turns part two on i'm actually excited to post this video <laughs> i want to see the comments <laughs> i just don't want anyone else to see this video because it's embarrassing <gasps> What the heck is this judgment card? Oh my god. I'm just hearing that they have some very shameful kinks and things that they like doing. Because I just feel like they like it really sloppy. And um, yeah, they're embarrassed of their cum face and they're really insecure about a lot of things. So yeah, just try not to judge them. And vice versa. And that's all I'm going to say for part number two. Let me know if I should do a part two. And I will. So yeah, pile number three, you guys chose the Ferrari card, okay? And so I'm hearing zoom 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 If you know where that's from, comment down below and I'll give you a free reading. If you know where that's from. Okay, but anyways, I'm hearing that this person is someone that likes it fast i'm really like they probably do it really fast like they like it just like super fast 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 um maybe they aren't that good at like having good da -da 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 -da, because i'm hearing like they just go super fast like it's kind of like bam slow down you know um like there's a stop sign over here if you can see so <clears throat> i feel like they're really into like fast and hard like 
false, false, false. So fam, if you're gonna be doing the, uh, I'm wearing the fast of the better fam. Like if you just go super, 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 super fast, like just go super fast, bro. Like you make it fast, but like they like the quickies, bro. They like it like, you know, in the closet. They like that spontaneous stuff where it's like, maybe you're at like, I was gonna say a family dinner and like sneaking in like, I don't know, a, a closet or something and like quickly doing it like five minutes or like um, eating you out in the bathroom. Like they like that whole, you know, spontaneous way. It's like, are we gonna get caught? Like what's gonna happen? Like they like that, like doing it out in public, which I'm not saying you should do because you can get arrested for that public indecency. Do not do that, okay? Do not be doing this stuff. Entertainment purposes only, but like I'm hearing like they like that whole way. It's like the court They like the chase. They like the whole fast thing where it's like what's gonna happen or like they like it doing it in the car bro Like yes, like I'm assuring that this person likes coming as fast as possible They're kind of like let's get the deed done. Let's go. Let's go fast. Let's go. Let's go So I'm hearing like they like it loud and everything, but I feel like um they seem like someone that's really aggressive, but I feel like they actually like it being really quiet in the bedroom. Like, I'm hearing, like, it's very fast and crazy, and it's kind of like, oh my god, like, what the fuck's happening? But, like, at the same time, I feel like they like it when it's just, like, quiet, and it's just, like, the two of you. And, like, just, like, longingly looking in the eyes, or, like, you know, being, like, that type of vibe. Like, it seems really, actually, romantic in a way. I don't know why, but it's, like, kind of sweet. I feel like, um, it's, like they are into you know the whole bedroom missionary like standard positions but i do feel like they're also into like the spontaneous vibe as well and yeah i'm just hearing them say like they want to do it like something crazy like they want to have a bucket this way it's like doing it on top of a mountain they want to do it like in every state every province like that type of vibe and like they might even want to bring some toys in like they think it's actually kind of cool if you have some toys maybe you haven't told your partner or partners that like you have like a vibrator or something i'm hearing like say i'm hearing them say like bring it with next time and like try it out and like do it in front of them i feel like they'd be really into it okay um or like if you like use strap-ons like i'm hearing like they wouldn't mind maybe like um like they could be a switch so i'm hearing like they wouldn't mind also receiving it okay so yeah they wouldn't mind receiving it i'm literally hearing them say that um but yeah they like it fast and quick and crazy and spontaneous okay um, I'm just hearing them say, let's get the job done. Let's get the job done. Let's get the job done. <gasps> Bro, we literally have the Six of Swords. And look at them. They're literally in a park outside. Like, that's what I was busy saying. Public indecency. Like, they just want to do it. They're saying, like, it doesn't matter where we are. Like, they just do it. Like, quickly. Like, I'm, I'm horny right now. Like, let's just do it. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm hearing, like, they like, like, even, even though, like, they're completely naked, I do feel like they could even be someone that, like, they're turned on where it's, like, you just, like, basically taking your pants off and being, like, okay, put it in. Put it in. Put it in. Just, like, doing that type of thing, you know, I feel like they like it, like, if you're, like, bratty, maybe they're into that, like, they like bratty subs, maybe. Um, yeah, like, I'm hearing, like, bottom vibes or, like, they are really turned on by that way. It's kind of, like, you saying, like, put it in me. Like, put it in, put it in, put it in. Oh, my God. I'm getting demonetized. I can't believe I'm saying this all. Anyways, so, yeah, um... Because I'm just hearing them say, like, they would do it with you. But, like, you don't even have to get fully undressed, bro. Like, I'm just hearing, like, you saying, like, don't even take your pants off the whole way. Let you just, like, put it halfway and be like, okay, put it in. Like, let's do it. Let's let's do it quickly. Let's do it fast. Like, quick, fast, okay? And, like, just a couple pumpies and then you're done. <laughs> three pumps, they done, bro. And pump is, like, um three poundings. I don't know what the English word is. Pump is, like, pump. So, yeah, if you guys don't understand my South African vibes. But, yeah. Um, okay, wait, there's an airplane. Okay, I only have 24 minutes left on my memory card, so that's very unfortunate. Very sad, because I wanted to keep talking. But, um, yeah, like, you know, I'm sure like, you don't even have to take your pants off the entire way. Like, bro, you can literally just, like, take it off halfway and, like, the same for them. Like, they're really into that, like, just, like, quick, fast, okay? Then we have the Six of Pentacles that came upright. So, yeah, like, I just feel like they're not very that high maintenance. It's kind of like it is what it is. I don't feel like they have any specific, like, you know, turn-ons. It's kind of just like, let's do it and finish it. They could definitely have a Venus in Aries or Venus in Virgo. Venus, yeah, I feel like they have, like, a, a, an actually an Earth sign because, like, Venus, not in Capricorn. Capricorns are freaks, bro. So I feel like they're more like a Venus in Taurus, Venus in Virgo venus in maybe even aquarius 
Pisces maybe even it just seems like they don't really have that much turned on turn ons per se okay it's just more like okay are you there are you five minutes are you ready okay let's go let's go let's go it's kind of just like let's do it now because um i'm busy for the next six hours so let's just do it now okay it's like that type of vibe so yeah and then we have the five of pentacles that came up right they're a really passionate person they like kissing they love kisses okay they love kissing with tongue kissing with no tongue actually i feel like they probably prefer without tongue i feel like they don't like kissing with too much tongue um they like it quiet they don't like a lot of a lot of music in the background they don't like too much distractions i mean yes they like distractions they like a lot of distractions but yeah i'm, I'm hearing they're not into that much music they don't like it when someone tries to be too sexy maybe like they don't like the whole like i don't know candles i feel like they aren't into the whole romantic vibe they're kind of just more like let's just do it okay like cut the bullshit like they just do but okay like pump the back but take the back seat put it down in and out that type of vibe um but yeah, they do like passionate kisses. I'm hearing like they love kisses, okay? They love, love, love kissing. Kissing is probably like better for them than sex. Like kissing felt, feels like sex for them. So, yeah. That is what I got for pile number three. I hope the video resonated. I love you loads. Okay, so I'm gonna actually um, finish with pile number three. I really hope the video resonated. I love you guys so much. And let me know if I should do a part two because I actually have three more piles that I'm not doing just because I'm gonna first see the reaction on this video and then I can make another one, like an in-depth one and I can do also like your first time with them and like all that jazz. Um, so yeah, let me know if you guys like this reading, if you guys like this side of me where it's just more promiscuous and everything. I love doing these videos. It's just really awkward because, you know, yeah. But yeah, I hope you guys like the video. Definitely let me know. And, um, yeah, if I should do a part two. Um, comment down below other videos you want to see from me as well. I love you so much. Be safe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!